Let's go. Good morning. Hey, you doing? <coughs> and you are knocked out. You ready to go to the gym? Yeah. Yeah, go get it in. Y'all gotta go get it in. And y'all for clicking. And I did go on. I've been up since like seven. I got it before D. She wants to admit that. You know, I'm just a in forever. <laughs> that was good. D, her timing is becoming better and better, y'all, ever since she's been in a relationship with me. Oh my god. For real, your comedic timing, you're on it now. It used to be very, very slow. I'll say a joke and she'll be like, what? What are you talking about? I'm like, jeez, my goodness. Don't you hate when somebody doesn't have like a good like sense of humor like senses you know good humor or maybe she's just like you know how is she catching on to my greatness you know what i'm talking about let me love me yeah i'm feeling good y'all i'm hyped up i'm ready to go to the gym uh, i'm glad y'all like my new shoes you know i'm becoming more and more like d just like she's becoming more and more like me got my water going gotta get the cute ice in there last me a little bit longer take my vitamins because you know I don't eat meat so if you don't eat meat I'm a pescatarian if you don't know you have to supplement ah for not getting meat uh, broke some ice and yep we're gonna use that and we're gonna use that yep because we don't waste yep because ain't number frozen water She's been stressed out, y'all. So keep in your, in your prayers. I love my baby. And I know that she's super strong. And she's she's fighting through all the work she has to do. She feels like she doesn't have a life. Because she's so busy with the kids and work. And I just have to do more of my part, you know, to help out. But it's with the kids, they like they're super clean. They want mommy. So that's where we are today. But your body's a no, what do you mean? Let me go, let me go. Jimmy's sleeping while they grow. So yeah, in Walmart, while they grow, I had to pick up a few things. I had to get, you know, my favorite yogurt. I got one last time and it was bad, y'all. Expiration had already passed when I bought it. Then I get some Raid. You know, I'm so random. I got two, two items. And then when you got the kids with the stroller, I can't get a basket. And they don't have the little handheld thing. So come on, Walmart, get together. Let's get some handheld baskets. So the fathers out there with the hands full. I gotta put, push the basket like this. I gotta push my kids like this while I'm holding y'all in the, the stuff I need. So we're gonna go ahead and head home and get this. Let's go. I really hope that baby's alright. See how baby's turning blue and I really pray that that baby's okay. Lord, please. Oh. 
got all these people that will help, man, because it's crazy. I was walking out of Walmart, and she was screaming, saying the baby wasn't breathing. Turning blue. She's alright because her mom calmed down. Man. Oh, my baby's sleeping. Man, that was scary. See how baby was turning blue, man. Seemed like. Things are right now. Stuff like that, you get signs in life that help you, you know, refocus and appreciate what you have. Especially when you see other people, the tough times, the hard times. Hopefully that little baby is alright. Like a little girl. She like she's around the same age as Jordan or younger. But uh, man, I don't want nothing to happen to no kids around the world. Kids are angels on this planet, innocent. They don't mean no harm, especially that young. I think we all get tainted as we get older by society and like adults, you know. But man, that was so scary. My heart was pumping. My heart was pumping. I started feeling for that mother, man, because the mother was screaming out, running, looking for help. It's crazy, man. So appreciate the little things in life. Appreciate. The fact that you're alive, you have all your loved ones around you, and you know, you have a roof over your head, little things. Hey, Grapevines. Oh my goodness. So, Jerry just got back from Walmart and he told me about um, the little baby that was outside with her mom, and like the baby couldn't breathe, like the baby stopped breathing. And oh my gosh, like that seriously just opened my eyes. Like, I was so stressed out earlier today, like, I was stressed out over, like, cleaning the house every day, having to clean it every day, and, like, I was stressed out about, like, my kids being super, super clingy, like, all they want is me, and, like, but I'm so thankful, like, that Walmart incident seriously put things in perspective and, like, really turned my mood around, like, I shouldn't be mad or, like, I shouldn't be stressed or, like, worried and, like, having anxiety over, like, cleaning the house and having so much to do and dealing with paperwork and like work and answering emails and then taking care of like two kids that always want mommy 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 and like but I love that like I love that I'm so thankful for my family and um I'm just I'm so I don't know I'm like automatically like just grateful and thankful and blessed because that could be any of us outside of Walmart and like you know, like, I can't, I can't even imagine that happening to one of my kids. Like, I just can't. I would be hysterical. Just hearing that makes me so thankful. And, like, my mood is just completely turned around because of that. Because I need to be more grateful. And I need to put things in perspective. Like, I'm alive. My kids are alive. My kids are healthy. Jerry's healthy. I'm healthy. Like, we're all just okay we're breathing you know jerry and i we both just prayed together for that mom and like the baby and her family um because i just wow like i just can't even imagine i'm just so grateful right now i'm saying all this to you know hopefully remind some of you guys to not sweat the small stuff and i know it can be hard and we can all become selfish or like kind of bratty but don't like try not to um try to be grateful for the little things like breathing and um having a roof over your head having food to eat like just being grateful for those things uh because there are a lot of people out there that don't have that and so yeah that whole walmart situation um i hope that the baby is okay and i hope that the family is finding peace right now and is spending and hugging and loving on their baby girl. I know that. Are we leaving? Great vines, we made it. Like y'all see. Great vines, we made it. Do vines? Oh, no, that don't sound right. <laughs> no. I'm going to come up with something. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs>
The Hefner. The Hefner. Yeah, something like that. The Hefner. Where y'all at? Follow the boy. No, Jerry. Say sorry, Jordan. Well, you're hitting the head on purpose. I'm your favorite, right? No, the kids, the babies. The babies, your favorite? I'm your second favorite? Yeah. Uh, all of them, my favorite. So I'm your favorite, too? Yeah. So I'm mom. So mom, we're at the mall. Where do you find? Yay! Good clap. Good job, you guys. What your kids did to my body. Woo! Mm -hmm. She's perfect, I'm so proud of her. I'm just happy. My daughter was born today. She's healthy. I just hope I'm able to do a good job like how I did for J3. Ma, pretty girl. Oh, ma, ma, pretty girl. Oh.